Welcome back. Let's get going. We're gonna stick with uh, Nenji. I didn't think I'd like this guy that much, but I do. I like him a lot. I guess when you put it like that, maybe you've got a point. I should slow down and think a little. Still, though. Uh, hey, are you even listening? Uh, I'm back. It's happening all over again. It doesn't matter if we run. We never make it out in time. We only got a couple minutes until they ruin this place. Even if I told someone about this, nobody would believe me. Who even is that voice? How'd I end up in this mess? Where the hell was I? It was like... I don't know. I feel like I saw it on some UFO show. It looked just like that. I was... Hey, Kisaragi. You don't have some kind of key handy, right? What does that even mean? I have the key to my house. Is this it? Nah, probably not. I mean, hell, even I've got some house keys. Okay, we need to do something differently. Arrival of Kisaragi's train. We need to leave. Or something before then. Hey, where are you going? Oh, hello. Isn't that... I feel like I know that guy she's with. Who is he? Why are you being all sneaky? Uh, I don't know. No reason. Wait, that's Iori over there. <sighs> what are you hiding from Iori? That's not it. What? Don't tell me you like Iori. Hey, it's not like that. <sighs> Isn't that... Karabe? Cor hey! I'm still talking to you here. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm still talking. <sighs> I think it would probably be Karabe. Stop dodging the question. I mean, Izumi. I want a real answer. For real, it's not like that. Hey, I'm still talking. <sighs> <sighs> then what is it like? What do you care? You're not my girlfriend. Why are you even getting so worked up? <sighs> It's not a big deal, I was just curious. Sheesh. Fancy meeting you here. Kisaragi's that? hanging around. Kinda hey, hard to talk way, to free right? Saka like this. Where are you going with Okina? Well, that's why we're going somewhere else. I know I saw Karabe around here. Must have gone somewhere. We don't have time for the ship, bro. Oh no. Well, look what we got here. Oh Ogata. no. Okay, I don't have time for your shit, bro. Try to run? You think I'd run from you? Huh? God damn it. God damn it, I fucked it up. We gotta retry it. I think I'm supposed to get on this train by myself. Hey. Hey, where are you going? Over in Where are you, Karabe? Kisaragi's hanging around. Kinda hard to talk to Fuyusaka like this. Wait. Okay, no. I know I saw Karabe around here. Must have gone somewhere. Get it. Get on the train then, or something. Hey, what's the wrong train? Okay. Good. 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 I thought it came too quickly. That's weird. I know they got on. Wait a second, isn't that um the the little sister? What's wrong? Are you looking for someone? Sure am, kid. You see a couple school kids uh, about my age? A couple school kids? What the hell? Was that like magic? Nah. What the hell am I thinking? Okay, look. I know this seems real sketchy. I mean, heck. I'm the guy who chased you onto a train here. But there's something I gotta know. Do you have some kind of key on you? I mean, not like a regular house key. It's supposed to be kind of special. 
Except I don't really know how. <sighs> yeah, this still sounds pretty damn weird, huh? Hey! The woman? Just running away for. Hey, hold on. Why? Why are you looking for something like that? Good question. Man, I don't know how I'd even explain it. You're looking for the key? <sighs> You're the one who originally carried it, young man. The school nurse? Wait, I was just talking to Fuyusaka. Wait a second. Is the school nurse Fuyusaka? What the fuck? That would- wait. <sighs> wait a sec. Are you Fuyusaka, or...? Wait. I know you. The League of Darkness. I remember now. You're one of the bad guys. This'll only hurt for a moment. <laughs> Playing this late? Should you be out here alone, young man? I'm not playing! I'm training! Say, you must be Nenji Ogata-kun, right? How about I walk you back to your house? Uh, you're fishy, lady. You talk like the League of Darkness people. They say all that same stuff when they kidnap kids. The League of Darkness? The bad guys from Common Hero, duh. Right, kids and their TV. But you know, I think you're the real bad guy here. Eight years from now, you're going to call a bunch of monsters and destroy the world. Am not! I'd never turn to the side of evil! You're still going to do it whether you're good or evil. Sometimes, things just happen. You can't trick me! I'm not Hold gonna it. get kidnapped! Little punk. Missed. Wait, the key. The key is to call the kaiju there? Close. I guess I just did a big lap around the block. What do I do? She even had a gun. She tried to shoot me. She really is from the League of Darkness. I gotta tell the police. Don't move. <laughs> You're a bad boy. Am I gonna die? It'll only hurt for a moment. <laughs> I've just implanted you with nano machines. It'll add onto the program inside you. It's not a huge change, but it's something we'll need to fight back. And now, we can prepare our weapons. The Sentinels. What? What the fuck? Man, that stinks. Uh, didn't I just get shot? Did you find the key? Okay. I still don't know what's going on here. But getting shot made me remember something. She shot me back when I was a kid, too. You were shot. I'm going to need you to explain the situation. I was on the train, and the nurse from my school shot me. There were even other passengers around, too. No, wait. That was definitely Fuyusaka. She was all grown up, but I know that was her. Wait a moment. Slow down. You're talking about trains. Where is this happening? the place you keep sending me back to. The train platform. And this happened when I chased Fuyusaka onto her train. So you're looking for the key on a train platform? Well, yeah. Wait, you mean you don't even know where you keep sending me back to? Okay, I see. That means the person with the key is somewhere around there. You just keep looking. Where do I get the explanation? Oh. What? Yeah. That is... That is something else. I think Iori is the nurse. I really do. Okay, let's do uh, Yuki's. If you need a if you need a refreshener, this was uh, about the doppelganger type thing. So many mysteries about what happened in the girls' bathroom, but one thing's for damn sure: Nachan's definitely involved. Got to look for more clues. Can't go wrong with apple juice. Me and Nachan used to drink it all the time when we were kids. There 
you are. I've been looking for you. <sighs> it's been several days since Minami-san has gone missing. She isn't sick, contrary to what her teacher says. And she didn't run away, contrary to the rumor that's been going around. It seems likely she was involved in something much more sinister. Maybe we should look around the girls' bathroom again. Oh, didn't I tell you? They've started renovating. Even if we can get inside, there's nothing to see anymore. Well, shit. That was fast. Are you upset with me? <sighs> Just been antsy without my cigarettes. This place is a dump. I'm your Watson, and you're Holmes. Maybe we should look around the. Oh, they've started. Oh, yeah. Even if we can. Well, oh, shit. Okay, there's something I haven't thought about. That damn four eyes. He says there's some spy agents. They may not put their honest. She was in the track room even during break. What was Not John doing? Something that the girl on the track team mentioned. She said Nachon went into the locker room to get a box and described it as some kind of UFO gadget. Hmm. Right before the incident in the girls' bathroom, there was another Kisaragi chasing after Nachon. Kisaragi is also one of the names on that list, so that means Four Eyes wants me to watch her. You know, I will say it's very difficult to do games like this, where the story unfolds as you do it. So, good on Atlas. It's not easy to do this shit. Shikishima, it's that company, so they're making. Have a minute. I got some things to ask you. Huh? She was. She's a name on the list in Four Eyes' file. Her name. She's pretty dull, actually. What? Okay, maybe I don't have anything to ask you, actually. Oopsie. Can I help you? No. This... She's innate. You're... You're the one next to her. Hurt. Tell me... Have a minute. I got some things to ask you. Now you. You've been going to Natsuno Minami's house, yeah? Any news since? Oh. I think I've asked all these people everything. So, uh... Yes? <gasps> I... Yeah, I remember all this. Yeah, there's something different here. We're supposed to do something different. Front gate. Tokisaka Shrine. Okay, we need to go to Tokisaka. Got it. I'm surprised I don't have that as a thinking point. Inter. Mm, the word has such a. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe we'll learn something at the athletics building. Minami. She skipped out on our lap, but I guess she did. She looked. She looked fine to me, right? <sighs> yeah. Okay, we need to go to the front gate somehow. Hello. I'm Takamiya with the SIU. So you're the student. So you're. What's the deal? We received confidential info about those. Cram it. Just to worry about your. Yeah, this is... I don't know. Maybe lacking information or something? It's possible.
I've asked everybody everything. Ooh, wait a second. Maybe not Chun's in here, or not. Okay, we can check the classroom, so. It's something to do with the front gate. I need some sort of, like... Someone needs to tell me about the front gate, I think. Okay, one second. I'm gonna see if I can figure this out on my own. Okay, I found this, um... I went to the notebook, and I saw this thing about Tokisaka. So this may be what I need. Yo, where's Tokisaka Shrine? It's nearby, actually. Okay, cool. I should go check it out. Take me there, will ya? I'm gonna go grab my bag. I'll meet you at the front gate. Cool. Shina no me. Hey. Yuki Takamiya, weren't you told not to contact me? Shino no me. There's something I need to speak to you about. <sighs> so, before Natsunomi Nami vanished, I heard she was being pursued by men in black suits. If that's true, you've got some serious explaining to do. <sighs> I've already told you. Natsunomi Nami has to do with my investigation, but I can tell you one thing for certain. We didn't kidnap her. If we had, there'd be no need for this investigation in the first place. Are you giving me your word on that? Get back to your assignment. Hmm. Tokisaka Shrine. Maybe Nachan went there. Either way, it's definitely a clue. Wait. There was something you said before. I haven't been able to stop thinking about it. You said you hid something for me. Oh, right. You told me to hide it. You don't remember, do you? It was in the passageway to the old school building. You were watching something. It was being shown through a projector, and you started crying. A projector? Yeah, and you were saying something about Four Eyes. Mr. Ida? Oh. So sudden. My pills. Shino no me. It wasn't too long after I transferred here. I saw her. She was near the old school building. Uh, did I fuck that up? Nope, I didn't. Okay. Hmm? I was thinking there were fewer people around here. So, this is the old school building. I heard it's gonna be demolished soon. No doubt it is old. It was built during the war. Seems like a shame, really. This place is so quiet. Would have been a perfect place to hang out. If I had been serious about my studies, I wonder if I could have got into Sakura the normal way. <laughs> yeah, right. Huh? My ID is now registered. I'm shutting off your AI function. Search for it. It's somewhere in your memory. Look for the information on me and Mr. Ida. It was all a lie. Is this me from the future? His love was nothing but empty words. Mr. Ida, he was using me right from the very start. I was such a fool. We are all that remains of humanity. And still we deceive each other. So filled with hate, I have had enough. This can't be real. Humanity has always been fated for ruin. Project Ark was a mistake, but it is already in its second stage. I cannot stop it. All I can do is derail it. I have linked in parts of the terraforming project. The heavy machinery will then purge humans from all sectors. If everything goes according to plan, the final phase will be reset, and all sectors will fall into a never-ending loop. What remains will be a peaceful world, finally free of humanity. No. I couldn't have. This place will be destroyed as well. The human race has reached its end. We have no need for a future. What in the hell? It can't be. Uh, uh, hey. <laughs> Wait a 
minute. You're the girl that was with Four Eyes. Shinonome, right? It's impossible. Are you okay? Did I do it? Was it really me? I destroyed the world? No, I won't believe it. Mr. Ida would never deceive me. What are you talking about? There's no way. That isn't my future. <laughs> Just take a deep breath, okay? Come on, stand up. Who are you talking about? Was it Four Eyes? If that's the future we're heading for, then what good are these? Shit. Medicine? Here. Don't you need these? Why? Why are you trying to help me? Well, I just... You're my senpai at the SIU, so... Uh. Oh, yeah. That thing is crazy. Is it a new kind of projector or something? <laughs> huh. So how do you work this thing? I want to see that video again. Huh? Hey! Are you alright? Get that thing out of here, please. Don't tell Mr. Ida. Don't tell anyone, please. Oh, wait a second. Was Yuki the one who put it in the laundry room? Okay to get up? Here, it's your medicine. <sighs> Morimura made you take those pills too. It was the first thing she did when I carried you in here. Are you sure it's okay to take so much of it, I mean? I don't understand. Why did you have my medicine? You threw the bottle on the ground, so I picked it up for you. I threw it? Yeah. Anyway, about that... thing. Are you sure it was okay? Huh? What? The thing you told me to hide. <sighs> I said no such thing. Are you trying to play games with me? You were babbling on and on about that damn four eyes. And crying. A lot. What? Me? Don't lie to me. What the hell is going on with this girl? It literally just happened. Ugh. Shit, seriously? God damn, girl. What are those for, anyways? I can't think straight unless I take them. I oh, know, dude. It looks like bad news to me. Oh. How are you feeling? I'm fine. Takamiya-san. Please, just stay out of this. <sighs> Is something wrong? No, it's just... You don't look too well. Maybe some medicine would make you feel better. Yeah. I'm out of here. Yeah, what the fuck's with all this medicine? Keep that shit out of here. I know, it fucks with your memory, obviously. Still, though. <clears throat> ah, Shinonome. I think we're getting close to unlocking everybody. Uh, did I count that wrong? Mm, there's still one more. Who is it? Oh, do you think it's Ida? Uh, Genko? I don't know what they call him anymore. <laughs> He's got so many fucking names at this point. Sure. Mr. Ida! 
Shinonome-kun. I have a question regarding what we talked about today. Will you answer it for me? <laughs> Mr. Ida? I thought I had made myself clear. You are to avoid contact with me while at school. I will make an exception this once. What is your question? It's about your feelings, Mr. Ida. You said I was special. You are special. The thing is, I felt it too. The moment you arrived, I knew you'd be special. That something might happen between us. Hmm? Girl, you're like 15. And I think this dude's 40. Mr. Ida, the substitute teacher. He's here to fill in while our teacher is on maternity leave. I've come to find he's quite mysterious. And comes with his own set of secrets. Mr. Ida, I've never... I've never felt this way before. Just thinking about you makes me... I have already explained to you what my position is. While you are important to me, to all of us, you and the rest of those chosen as pilots, your well-being is of the utmost importance to the mission. You do understand what I'm saying, don't you? Please don't cause any trouble for me, Shinonome-kun. <sighs> it is true you are quite exceptional, Shinonome-kun. Your intelligence and adaptability are above average, and your piloting technique is more than sufficient. With you on our side, we stand a real chance. But you must be fully committed to the cause. To achieve victory, one must prepare with a full heart and great tenacity. The internet has been talking of nothing but what happened last week. A group of invaders had come ashore, their attack held back by a mysterious robot. Mr. Ida, is your only desire to put me inside one of those things? If we don't defend against the attacks on this city, it is no exaggeration when I say that the world will be destroyed. We succeeded in defeating them in the first battle. By ensuring that they were unable to reach the heart of the city, we were able to minimize the damage that was done. But the invasion is just beginning. That attack is nothing compared to what's coming. Hey, what's going on here? Huh? What the fuck's A doing here? A-kun. Weren't you the one that said not to contact you? What do you want with Ryoko-senpai? Sekigahara-kun. Stop, A-kun. I'm the one who has to talk to him. Senpai... That is true. Nevertheless, we're drawing attention to ourselves. I'm leaving. Wait! I'll do it. If it's what you want, then I'll fight. Are you certain? Yes. I've made up my mind. Then we will meet after school. I'll give you more details then. Wait. I'm in too. You will fight as well? Yeah. I'll do it. I'll go with Ryoko-senpai. That is excellent news. Then I will see you after school as well. Are you sure about this? I am. Ryoko... You know, I'm trying to get all the ships right, because obviously, you're not going to get a choice. Oh shit, this looks awesome. Area B2, Matsuyuki Cho secured. Area D7, 23 remain in the 7th wave. Oh, wait a second, those are two different people. Number 14 has secured a path, just a little more. Don't stop, you're almost there. Number 14 has taken damage. Shinonome-kun, pull back. You know what? I can still do this. Number 17, assist number 14. Number 17, no response. Miss Morimura, something's wrong. I'm not getting a response from Sekigahara either. The system's being attacked. From where? Through the laser link. The attack is originating from number 15. Sekigahara-kun? Sekigahara is transmitting it to every sentinel. Abnormalities in their system. I 
this rate. They're going to be wiped out. Use the force transmit code on all units. But we don't have time to adjust the settings. Do it as is. The link will be shut off that way, but we'll have no idea where they go. The pilots' lives are the priority. Number 16 and 13 have begun transmitting. Number 12 and 19 transmitted. Number 14 has completed transmission. No response from the others. How did this happen? The kaiju are almost here. We need to go. We can figure out the reason afterward. I was able to access the autonomous type number 8. We can buy time with that. You two, head for the gate. Itakun. Please hurry. I'd rather not die a meaningless death. Miss Morimura, we need to go. to the very end, all so we could escape. <laughs> Wait a second. Is Minako a fucking pilot? This must be his hideout. 426 is a dangerous criminal. It'd be foolish to go in unarmed. Remember what Mr. Ida said, to achieve victory. One must prepare with great tenacity. Prisoner number 426. That's what he was called when imprisoned in the future. And now he travels through time, trying to thwart our work. I bet you that's Izumi. I 100% bet you that's Izumi. A gun made in the 2100s. If it comes down to it, I'll use this on him. There's still some ammo left. <gasps> no, it's Are not. Son. It's fucking I. I've got you cornered now, 426. It's time to pay for what you've done. Whatever it is you're trying to do now, I don't care. But I can't forgive you for what you did to Mr. Ida. Because of you, he's... You... you're still going on about Ida? There's nowhere left to run, 426. Who told you I was 426? I saw the access logs. It was you, Eisaki Gahara. The program that infected the Sentinels. It was created with 426's ID. Looks like someone left some foolish evidence behind. We're done talking. I should kill you right here. <laughs> then do it. Shoot me. Go on. I'm serious. I'll do it! Huh? The trigger's locked. I'm the registered user. It won't shoot me. <sighs> I'll take you on myself. Really? With those injuries? Besides... What are you doing? Empty. Like I thought. They'll wear off soon. <sighs> I'm sorry, Ryoko-san. I tried. But I couldn't save you. Hmm. Okay, you guys remember that one... Fast forward to the nurse, and I thought it was Juro. Maybe it's not Juro in that scene. I don't know. Yes. Easy. Take your time. 
Do you know where you are? Do you know what year it is? 1985. What's the last thing you remember? 426. He got away from me. I won't let him escape next time. I see. All right. How are you feeling? My head really hurts. Maybe I should keep you here for further observation. My internal clock just needs a bit to readjust. You're putting too much of a burden on your nervous system. You need to stop shifting. Do you still have your pills? Make sure you're taking them. This should make me feel a little better. Take those when your headaches start to get bad. The medicine is a bit strong. You may experience some temporary side effects. But don't worry, your memories will return quickly. I need to go back. You can't time travel right now. But I need to fix the Sentinels before the invasion begins. You can't stop me. I need to go after him. I'm not trying to stop you. We just can't use the gate right now. The invaders appeared in 2064. They destroyed the world, but they won't stop. They're coming for us here, too. Why can't we time travel right now? The gate has been sealed by someone. I'm looking into it. The gate is locked. There's only one person who could have done it. It's him. It has to be. 426. The one that set up the gates in the first place. So we're stuck here? In the past? Are you all right? Who are you? Hmm. Miss Morimura, are you still overworking her? I've had no choice. And you are? Renya Goto, a second year, like you. I've been assigned to offer you support. <sighs> the source of the disaster that will destroy the world. If we don't capture 426, there's no way we'll be able to withstand the invasion. See, I don't believe that for a second. Because, uh, the maid, <laughs> the nurse, gave off the impression that uh, Tunnel Snake Boy would be the one to call the invaders. So, I don't know. It's a pleasure to be working with you. It's only a matter of time before 426 makes contact with someone. I need the list of those who are compatible. Of course. That includes the people of this era, too. I'll see what I can do. There's no other option. If we don't find him, the result will be worse than anything we imagined. <sighs> or would you rather I go ask the students, one by one? <sighs> Fine. The file is on my desk. It isn't everyone, but it does list those who are compatible at this school. If I get any information on him, I'll let you know immediately. Humans with the capacity to pilot the Sentinels. They have already been identified in the future. I'll fix it as soon as I can. The coordinates for shifting through time, they're set in 40-year intervals, so he can't travel freely. These pills are hard to swallow, but it's the only way these headaches will go away. I don't need any help. I can do this on my own. It's too dangerous for you. Please, go with him. This isn't 2065. You will follow my orders. Gotokun, I leave her to you. Understood. We're counting on you. Is this dude just gonna follow me around? So this is it. The plan to gather all the compatible ones. Four girls, including myself. Wait, only girls? Fuyusaka and Kisaragi. Class 1B. Yakushiji and 1C. All of the compatible girls are first years. These files are only for the girls. That's all we have here. Gotokun has information on the boys. You can consult with him. He's right in front of me, so he can just tell me. Tell me who the compatible boys are. Certainly. But there's something I'd like to ask you first. I wonder, why do you hate 426 so much? Are you serious? The fate of the world is at stake. Even so, I sense your hatred stems from something else. 
the source of the disaster if we don't ca Because he ruined the Sentinels. Because he destroyed my home. That thing deserves no sympathy. 426 is not human. He's an AI created in the future. And now, he calls himself A. Sekigahara. Hmm. Wait. Is she being fucking serious? Or, like, just demeaning? Wait a second. You're Holy shit. No. No, wait a second. That robot we saw when we were doing Tunnel Snake and Mona. You know that robot AI thing? Was that I? Oh my god. It totally was. Tell me who the compatible boys are. 426 could try and contact one of them. Or maybe he already has. According to the clock on the wall, it is time for lunch. They should be in the cafeteria now. Let's go. So crowded. So, where are the compatible ones? I don't see any from here. Huh? Shinomi-senpai. Good timing. We were just looking for you. That's Shu Amiguchi. He's one of them. I have a question for you. Have you seen someone that looks like this? Hmm. No. Never seen him. I see. Oh! Ah, oh, jeez. Were you able to get your bread? You need my help with anything? Yeah, I need your help with fucking off. About last time, I wasn't able to do anything then, but I want to make up for it. You did try, and I'm grateful to you for that. Where are you going? Would you quit talking to me in front of other people? What is this strange feeling? Wait a second. Shu? Is that, is that the ship? Shu and you? When I see him talking to another girl, my chest feels so tight. It feels like I'm jealous. No. About him? That's ridiculous. There's no way. <sighs> my head. It hurts. Now what? This should make me feel a little better. Doesn't look like I can push my way through. Shu Amiguchi. I get a strange feeling when I think about him. It's almost like I'm in love with him. I don't have the list. Therefore, I don't know. Renya Goto has the information I need. A picture of 426. He calls himself Aseki Gahara now. But he's gone into hiding. The one that ruined the Sentinels. The disaster that will destroy the world. If we don't capture 426, there's no way we'll be able to withstand the invasion. Fuyusaka and Kisaragi, Yakushiji in 1C. All of the compatible girls are first years. The first year classrooms are on the third floor. Okay. What now, Buckaroo? Doesn't look like a. Does. Where are you going? Time to find the compatible girls. Where are the compatible ones? I should look at the pictures in their files. I don't see them. Hmm. You don't have to follow me. Don't say it like that. My job is to help you. Doesn't seem likely. You haven't been doing a lot of helping. It's been creepy. Tell me, Kisaragi. Yeah, don't mind me. Why don't you tell me what you've gathered so far, so I can better assist you? Why do you sound like a robot? Oh shit, it's also been 45 minutes, so uh, we'll call it quits here. Thanks for watching, guys.
enjoying the story still a lot, and uh, yeah, I don't even I don't even give a fuck about the gameplay, the battles. <laughs> if I never have to do those, I really don't care. So, I will though. Of course I will. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys.